Okay, my name is Stefano Daino and uh, I'm the main developer behind the SP4. We are showing here at the NAM uh, show the new version of the SP4, that is version 4. And uh, behind the SP4 there is a long story because there are more than uh, 10 years of developer development. And uh, we are showing here a new version that is able, to, which is introducing some new features. The SP4 is uh, a two-track editor and uh, plugin hosting uh, and uh, uh, mastering application to do CD-ROM. Um, it is able to burn internally and it is able also to export files as DDP2 files for compatibility with other applications and uh, manufacturers. Um, now I'm going to show you, uh, I can uh, do editing uh, on the waveform as you would expect doing something like this. There are some uh, basic functions that you can apply, like a normalization, and everything can be do undone. And uh, with the speed of, I can cut, for example. And uh, this version is also the new cut editor, when I can easily do cutting like this. So here is the point of the clock, so I can just very easily add uh, crossfades between tracks to trim cut points hearing the result in real time. And um, this new version has a very also impressive the clicker. We worked a lot on that. So you can uh, just take a new file and say, for example, I'm just showing this. And uh, just to load, let uh, the SP4 to analyze the new files, I'm sorry. Ah, it's here. It's already here. So just to show you what's happening here, there are, you see there are some clicks over here that you can see from the waveforms. I'm going to do processing, repairing the, this action, and here you can see that uh, this was the source, this is the processor, and uh, I removed the click, so like you can see. I can monitor the, the source of the residual or the processing sound, but uh, this is what's done showing you some example more more easily I can show you that in this point you see which was the previous waveform and what is what I remove it so this was done automatically by the application by the clicking so this new version introduced the capability to do restoring or audio files from vinyl from old recordings um, from the audio CD perspective, you can very easily burn your audio CD just dragging over here your audio files and uh, just cutting new uh, CD-ROM tracks, creating uh, overlapping between tracks or just adding pause on your cd -re. And what you can see here are your CD tracks. You can very easily add the CD text Yes, MP, MPQ code directly to, ready to be bar, to burn. So from here, you can just uh, also export the Audio CD Loud as Audio CD ROM DDP files or just to burn CD ROM directly from here. CD ROM is, uh, is totally compatible though, with the uh, Red Book uh, standard, include the, uh, the CD text, ES, RP, MPQ code detering inside. If you wish to apply plugins, it's very easy. You can apply plugins on the single tracks, having uh, uh, the capability to add, uh, sorry, I'm sorry, a serial chain of plugin over here, which can be chosen between internal effects, other unit plugin or VST plugins, which can be different track by track, or can, can, they can be common to the old um, CD track directly from here. If you wish just to apply some plugins or more, even more, you can add how many uh, racks that you wish on, uh, on your plugin chains. So this will be applied on the full CD for the mastering purpose. Um, ESP4 includes also a batch converter, so you can uh, also do some common processing on several files. 
just dragging portion of your files on the batch processor like this. So I can, for example, export a single region of my CD or my audio files directly from here, applying some common process on all the files of the list. So I can take another part here, just over here, and I can do a common process over here. I can export, very easy. If I like this, this uh, piece of music, for example, just drag this on, uh, on Document Manager and I have my audio directly exported. So, uh, the SP4 boasts to as audio editing for mastering. So it's a waveforms editor with a sample precision, latency compensation. It's, uh, the target is mastering. And this is the purpose of our, our job. Thank you very much. Um, when is this new version shipping and how much is it? Um, this version is already shipping. The price uh, is 99 US dollars. And we are also doing a very special promotion that will, uh, will be extended for some months from now for bias pick users that uh, can benefit of 50% less. So for a bias user it would be uh, 50 US dollars. For the full version usually it's 99. And it's already available from our website, that is www.dsp4.com. And uh, anyway, just look on the web before I show you the name. So uh, it's dsp4.com. Thank you very much.